everyone, welcome back to my channel. I'm just sitting on the ground at the moment because I've been filming all day and I really want to film this video on this particular day as well. So I thought, why not just sit down and just chill and chill with my doggy as well, Daisy. She's a little bit grumpy because she's been keeping me company on her blanket here. But yeah, one more video and we're done, okay? In this video, I wanted to show you guys my Korean beauty wish list because the last one I did was about a few months ago and I did not finish up my wish list. Like obviously, it was really hard to buy stuff during lockdown. So there are still a few things from that um, video that I haven't bought yet. But I do want to do another video because there's so many products that has came out that I really want to put in my wish list. And I want to show you guys what I have in my wish list just in case you guys are wondering because when the lockdown is over, these are the products that I will do my best to try and get them as much as I can because obviously, you know, all this build up and it does cost money. So let's get started. The first one will be this new collection in A2 House and this is their Play Color Eyes Rose Wine. And this one, oh my god, this looks so beautiful. This one is just like obviously champagne pink color, rose gold shades. They all just look so, so beautiful. I just want to play with this one already. Like, oh, I just really want this so badly. This one also comes with um, lipsticks as well and it does have, this one is called the Etude House Better Lips Talk Velvet Rose Wine and this one comes in five colors and the colors are obviously like your usual pink colors. They have three warm tone shades and two cool shades. The one that really attract me the most is probably PK003 because it's like a mauve pink shade but again this is like actually a cool undertone base. Another product is a lip product and this one is by the brand Roman and this is their milk tea velvet tint and oh my god the colors ranges like shock me because I'm like yes they are brown colors they're actually brown colors I mean there are two brown shades that have like red undertone base but the other two like this one is like completely like chocolate brown shade and another one is like a tan brown I just need to have them in my collection so I really want to give this one a try as well I do have quite a bit of lip products here guys and this one is the Mamonde creamy tan color balm intense mini peach like special set my god so long and this one comes in four and apparently this one is online and exclusive actually i like it's not four it's actually it comes in three and it comes with like a special soap as well but again they are obviously mini edition i've tried the crayon lip pencil once i think but i don't remember much about it so really keen on trying this but the color that really attract me is probably number 15 because it's like a brown shade. Another Etude House collection. I think this one has been out for a while but obviously I couldn't get my hands on them. And this is their Etude House Strawberry Blossom Kit. And this one comes in four items and apparently this is drugstore exclusive. And it comes with the Play Color Eyes Mini, comes with one berry mousse tint, comes with an eyeshadow brush and uh, what base brush and a blending brush because it's cherry blossom and it's springtime in Japan and Korea. This is the Innisfree Jeju Cherry Blossom Mist. I didn't look much into what it does but I heard the word mist. I heard cherry blossom. I was like I need to get this. So apparently this one helps to brighten up your face and it formulates with Jeju Cherry Leaf Extract for clearer and brighter skin. So apparently you spray onto face and you can apply this before and after makeup. So yeah, I've been obsessed with this so I really need this in my collection. And then this one is the Hera Central Powder Matte. I feel like this is... I've added something similar for my last wish list as well but this one is another four colors and this one the colors are gorgeous, especially Hear Me is so beautiful and especially Pampas as well, like just a nude beige shade. I just need to have it but the only problem with Hedda is that like it's really pricey. Like this one is really like 35 USD dollars for one so yeah so if I were to get it I might not get the whole collection, I might just get one but I don't know, we'll see. And then this one is a lipstick set and this is from the brand The Face Shop and this is FMGT Rouge Mini Kit. So each kit comes in six um, mini lipsticks and they do have four 
not three shades to choose like three collections to choose from but the one I really want is the one that it says all about MLBB because obviously it has MLBB colors and the colors look gorgeous and I mean they also have all about coral and all about red but I'm not really into those colors because I feel like those colors are really similar but MLBB looks really really good so I do want to get this and it's really affordable, it's only like 23 USD so if you think about it, it's about less than 4 USD dollars for like one of the mini lipsticks. And one of my cushion just fell off, but it's okay. And then this is also another kit and this is the Dear Dahlia Paradise Dream Velvet Lip Mousse. When I saw this, I couldn't believe the price because I was like, wait, Dear Dahlia, that like, this price is actually really affordable. Obviously, this is a little mini set, but honestly, I don't mind because Dear Dahlia is really, really pricey, but I do want to try this. And this kit, my god, guys, when I saw this, I was gobsmacked. Like, I was like, I need this. I need this right now because of all or all six of them are all brown shades like I need to have them like they all look so beautiful they all look different there are some cool tone shades warm shades but I just need to have this okay so I really really want this and hopefully when I'm able to get this it's not sold out so this is the teddy bear collection they do have other collections as well but this is the one that really attract me the most there are two um ten here they are not latest but I really do want to get them because they are really cheap and they are from Beauty Korea more so this is by the brand Lily by Rate. I tried it once in my lipstick haul and you guys say that you guys really like Lily by Rate as well you guys will also love the price of this so the Lily by Rate Bloody Liar Coating Tint is actually currently on 2 USD for one the retail price is usually about 9 USD but Beauty Korea Mall is selling it for 78% off and usually the reason why they do that is means that the expiry date yep so it says here the expiry date is in September but for me if I can get this before September I really want to do a review I want to give it a try this is a good opportunity for me to actually try all this out so I really really want this I mean how affordable it is guys like it's so cheap and the other one is also by the brand Lily by Rate and this is their Mood Liar Velvet Tint and again this is USD dollars and it comes in 5 shades as well and the expiry date is also September but I really want it. Next is the Sam Silk Hairstyle 1 Minute Shadow so obviously it is a shadow for your hair to cover up any grayness or like um make your forehead looks much more smaller as well I do have a lot I don't know if you guys can see I have a lot of gray hair at the moment and hence why I really want to get it because I don't want to dye my hair too much but I do need to dye it again really soon so I thought I'll give this one a try because it looks very interesting yeah I really want to give it a try it does have two different shades so I'll probably go for I don't know, depend when I color my hair, depend when I get this, that they do have two shades, one in natural black and one in natural brown. Foundation that I'm interested in is this Holika Holika Heart Cover Foundation. And this one is a glow foundation. They have SPF of 50 and it comes in five shades. So I'll probably get number 510. Obviously, it gives you like a glowy finish. And yeah, it just looks really beautiful. And it does look like it is pretty high coverage. And this one is by the brand Roman. And this is their little eyeshadow set. And this is their Better Than Eyes Milk series. I am interested in probably the purpley shade but I'm not sure so this is dried lavender you guys recommended me to try the Roman eyeshadow palettes out because you guys said that it's actually pretty good so yeah if I were to get one I would definitely get number one dried lavender because it looks unique it's purple and is a bit out of my comfort zone but I am keen on trying this out more lip products would be this one here and this is by the brand Misha and this is their red edition their roots to go kit I do have one of their red lipstick collection I think but obviously this is a mini one and this one comes in five six one two three four five six colors and there is one particular that really fascinates me and I'll put a picture here it looks very shimmery and glowy and glossy I just 
I just need it. It just looks so beautiful. So yeah, and this one is really affordable. It's about 24 USD for six. So again, it's about $4 for one. So that's actually not too bad. Another lip product, which is a new collection. And this is from the brand Innisfree. And this is their 2020 new color Real Fit Matte Lipstick. I tried Real Fit Matte Lipstick before and honestly, they are really good. They are really smooth and they are magnetic packaging as well. I love anything magnetic. And the colors here all looks really gorgeous, but the one that really fascinates me is number 11. So I'm really keen on getting all this five. They are leaning more toward like obviously the spring color. So like coral shade, light tone, warm, muted pink color as well and orangey shades. One mascara that I'm keen on trying is from the brand Natural Nature Republic Botanical All Day Fixer Cara. If I'm not wrong, this potentially might have fiber in it, but I'm not sure. But I do want to give this one a try because I don't often use Korean mascara, and currently I'm using the BT Cosmetics one. But I do want to explore more mascara options, so that would be the first product I do want to try. This one is more of like a lip care. Product, but I'm gonna put it here because you guys always ask me what I use for my um, lips but I do want to get the scrub and this is the Sam Honey Oatmeal Lip Scrub and it's pretty affordable as well so obviously it helps you scrub your lips you know to make your lips feel smooth and not patchy so yeah this one is a foundation and this is the It's Skin Life Color Thin Cover Up Foundation the SPF is actually really low this is only SPF 25 and this one comes in two shades only so I would definitely get number three, uh, 23 natural beige. I don't know what attracted me because half of the description I don't understand it but I do want to give it a try because I've never tried its skin foundation before so yeah. This one is also probably the same line but this is their concealer version so the it's skin life color thin cover up concealer and this one again comes in two shades so i'll probably get number two beige because i feel like number one iry is just too white and pale on my skin and we're nearly there guys nearly there three more so this one is an eyeshadow palette and this is by the brand bbi air i wasn't aware that bbi air do have eyeshadows so when i saw this i was like i need to get this and this is their finer shade palette it does come in two colors but the one really attract me is the one that has the purple packaging and oh my god the shimmers in here looks gorgeous I just need to get it like especially the purpley mauve shimmer shade attract me the most another concealer which I've heard good things about and I heard that is very high coverage is this Petty Pella Petty Pella Petty Pella double long wear cover concealer and this one comes in three shades and I will probably get number three. This one is great for under eye area, for any spots. And this one, people also use it for the lip area to create like a gradient um, lip look. So yeah, I am keen on trying this. But actually, number three do look quite dark. So maybe I might give... I don't know, maybe number three can be like for the face area. And then maybe number two could be for the lips. I'm not sure. But I will decide close to the time which shade I'll get. So I hope you guys enjoyed this and let me know if there's any products you are interested in and you want to recommend to get me to get them. Put them down in the comment box below because I will probably be interested but hope you guys enjoyed this and I'll see you guys on my next video. And Daisy, you want to say bye? Say bye? Say bye? Say bye bye. Bye bye. Bye. Alright, bye guys.